Hey guys, if you're not able to watch my long form content or podcast, here are some short form clips for you to enjoy. But I've never asked you this question. Why did you get into this world of being a fitness influencer guru and even having a world class business about it? So what's the story? Where did it start? It actually started uh, quite early. Uh, when I was growing up, uh, we were living in a joint family. and my dad's younger brother used to be a great table tennis player we had a table at home and every day in the evening some 15 20 of his friends would come home and the vibe used to be once again impacted. 50 20 people would come into your house yeah. to play table tennis they would play for 3 to 4 hours right and all the kids would be watching this yeah all the kids would be watching and, and playing also so we had no option than to you know just pick up the bat bat and play because playing a sport was so glamorized uh, back in the days in my house so that is where it actually started in table tennis is a fast sport requires a lot of agility and things like that so it started there i picked up table tennis so my fitness journey started with playing a sport and then uh, uh, because i had an opportunity of playing with people at home there were many good players who were coming to my house so i just got into playing table tennis well and was the icsc champion at some point very early uh, in my school days and then later i picked up basketball uh, loved that sport played that for many years in junior school uh, so for many many years i was just playing sports what also ha- happened i started lifting weights around the age of 14 and that was a very different story so i was a very skinny kid uh, and because of that i was subject to bullying and a lot of body shaming and uh, you know all kind of unpleasant experiences especially to do with how you look so i wasn't very happy about where was this which part of india Uh, I I'm from North India. I was born in Agra. Uh, I studied in uh, partly in Nainital, partly in Dehradun, a little bit in Agra. So it was all in all uh, those places. Uh, so quite a bit of uh, you know unpleasant experiences happened. And uh, someone told me that if you go and start lifting weights, it will probably help you bulk up uh, because that's what happens, and it will maybe help you in what you want to achieve. So what is the starting point in this lifting weights? Like it was on small dingy uh, gym yeah. <laughs> in the school or in the city or something like that? Yeah. So it was a very small, uh, very small gym in the city in in Dehradun, and uh, my first experience at the gym was quite bad. So I went. I was very skinny. I had a lot of experience in playing a sport, but lifting weights nowhere close to uh, doing that. And in the first session, uh, the trainer pushed me quite hard, and I couldn't. I didn't know how to lift weights, so I just couldn't do it very well. And at the end of the session, he told me, "Tujhse nahi ho payega, bhai. Tu ghar ja." It hurt my ego. The next day, I was so sore that I also got a fever. I'm sensing. I'm sensing. You know, if you go back in your time capsule, this is where. when you decided to start your fitness journey this thought was in your head don't over push people in their first workout exactly do so this trainer over pushed you and then what happened then i was uh, i just couldn't whatever he was asking me to do i couldn't do that much so he just told me this is not for you uh, not in a very rude way it did hurt my ego uh, went home wasn't very happy about it next day i got fever because of so excessive soreness and excessive fatigue and then i thought maybe lifting weights is not for me done but then at some point later another 6 or 7 months or so my brother my younger brother who still works with me uh, he told me just give it one more shot so there was another gym called power pack gym in in dehradun and we walked into that gym uh, it was 400 rupees a month of membership very expensive for me at that point uh, then i thought let it be anyways this is not for me i've been told so he said no let's do it let's let's give it one more shot okay and then i started going to the gym the first day i walked in saw a bunch of bulky very muscular guys guys i was intimidated but then all of them were so helpful they taught me you know how to go up you were still about 14 15 years of age i was still 14 15 okay. 14 years of age to be precise uh they were like very helpful they you know taught me the right kind of movements they also told me not to go crazy about it they told me a little bit about uh, nutrition at that time i mean nutrition advices were just flowing uh, a little all over the place but whatever they knew they were helping me out with it what i took away from it is just eat a lot of food so i did that i lifted weights and i started bulking up all of that happened uh, and throughout so many years i've been through those journeys of gaining weight losing weight and all of that has happened with me but that is not important what is important is that weightlifting was something that came as magical to me 
actually a personal transformation experience not from the point of view of how i look but from the point of view of how i feel and then i decided that i'm never going back this is something that hey guys if you've enjoyed this clip then click here and watch the full episode and don't forget to subscribe because your body is the most expensive real estate and i'm your real estate agent